Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Hello. Yes, yes. Hello. Hello. Yes, yes. Hello. Hello. We can hear you. Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. President. Yes, sir. Bwanji Bolur. Bwina Bwanji. Yes. First, I'm feeling sorry for you. Your complaint, you could see one of my problems with the civilian that we know. That's one. That's very bad. That means the economy is still going to be. And so I feel sorry for that. What of the rest of the grass will keep on up and with the ones? Ah, it's true. 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 It's government Hello? Yeah, but, but yes. wait, a, wait a minute. Uh, surely, I think let's leave that the issue of the of the of the young man aside. Okay. Let's leave that one aside because we don't know the circumstances. Okay. Uh, how okay. that boy died. So I think let's leave that one aside. Um, please let's leave okay. that one aside. Mm. Okay. 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 When we are changing them, the, the government, mm -hmm. we change for the better. We don't change for the well. Mm -hmm. Now, the problem is that we have power, we have power, we have power, we have power. And now, you would find the people you want to refer. We want to refer to the good things. We want to refer to the bad things. Mm -hmm. We should not live like that. We have to attend and we have to attend to the people. You you must live by by example. Plan is a good thing. Ah, when I go to the PF, when I go to the VOE, I will do different. Exactly. Now the problem, yes. Now the problem, you would find we are much more voted a foot. Now what am I saying? Good thing. Ah, but we are going to change. Now you would find this the same things. When I go to the PF, we are popular. We are going to make some money. We are going to make some These things are coming back again. Mm. Now, who do we blame? Who do we blame? We are going to blame our men who is in charge. And I went through these things. Why are you doing them? You know? Mm. Now, if you keep quiet, we are showing you you are going to be Oh, no, mm. you, Do you hear me? What I'm saying? Yes, yes, I can hear you. Yes. Because you are not going to be able to do you're not saying anything on Hatabe Z, which you always have to tell them to move on. Because these people, they must learn something. But if you are not going to be able to get in all of them, you will vote. It is not going to be able to get in all of them. But you will come back, you are a victim. But because them are in power, they never felt. So for me, I'm very sad what is happening with this government. Because 
They attacked you. If you are not going to be able to come back, you will come back. 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 That's a democracy. So I will leave it there. I won't go further than that. Thank you. Hello? 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 Yes, please. Hello? Hello? Yes, we can hear you. Yeah, good evening, Atayani. Good evening. Yeah, Patrick from Andorra. Okay, Patrick, please go ahead. Uh, 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 Government tidy involved. Therefore, we shall have just one question or two. We share a plan to go to Arungu, take over Wadi, Wadi, Avantu Vade, for whichever Rungu ever they pay and go and walk up over ever they shoot the figure. But I care about my age, which I mention my pains in a shell and in now we want to show the IHS to say as if he, we are saying ah, mona, 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 ah, ah, listen, 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 listen. I have already said, I have already said when uh, when President Ed Galung was there, I used to condemn those who were putting, you know, these uh, uh unfortunate situations on Lungu. I used to condemn it. I used to condemn it. So even now. Even now, uh -huh, so, I am not changing. So, I mean, <laughs> I think that, cha that uh, uh, we, we know the answers already. You can't ask the questions when we have already spoken about it. So, I mean, <laughs> why are you asking? We have already, yeah, so, we have already spoken uh, about uh, that. Let me just finish now. I, I know. It's, it's talk about something now. else. I'm not interested uh, in, in these things. We are, I, I'm not no. interested in this. I want to talk about something else. I'm not interested in this because yes, I'm, yes, I'm already you are guided. to say, mm. but uh, yes, you have already, you have already said about it. So I've already guided on that one. I mean, what is wrong is wrong. So come on, what is there to talk about? As far as I'm concerned, take those debates elsewhere, not on my platform. As far as I'm concerned, on my platform, I condemn the politicizing of unfortunate incidences i condemn that i condemn that whether it is upnd whether it is pf i condemn the politicizing of uh, uh sad incidences i condemn it i condemned it during the time of pf i am condemning it even now let us you know uh look at situations as they are and sympathize with a family and urge the government to compensate the people and not to start politicizing because you are politicizing i don't want to politicize these incidences nakana don't politicize them because if you start saying hey but lungu uh, but when valungu was there vale but valungu ever lay pair no shan shani ah ah that is politicizing that is politicizing you know we know it's not Balungu was sending those people. And we know it is not HH who is sending these people. So why are we politicizing it? Please let us not politicize it. Let's talk about other issues. Napa Pat. Hello? Good evening, uh, President Daly. How are you? Fine, fine. Thank you. Okay. Uh, um, my, I think my focus would be on uh, UPND and its governance. Uh huh. Look, I'll be honest with you. I'm, I'm one person that doesn't like uh, Oman Musa because of his uh, behavior mm -hmm. when they were in power. Mm. But the truth is, the way UPND is using police to intimidate politicians is pathetic, mm. for lack of a better term. Mm. HH was supposed to be our president for all Zambians. We rallied behind HH despite the things that they told us, despite the many warnings that they got. We voted for him, put him into power, thinking that he will be 
our Messiah, if we can say that. Mm. HH was supposed to be somebody that was going to turn around our economy. Mm. And as it is, we know there are many factors mm. that are affecting the economy and are causing it to, to be where it is now. Mm. But one thing that UPND has in control mm. right now, at the moment, mm. is to give Zambia the democracy that PF did not give it. Mm -hmm. Now, it is disheartening to see that the very HH that went through the torture of PF mm. is bringing those things back, and in its early term. Mm. And what HH should realize and UPND is that they are not popular. Mm. They did not win the elections because HH is popular. No, they won elections because Zambians wanted to teach PF a lesson. Mm. It wanted to teach politicians a lesson. Mm. And now, the way UPND is treating other politicians, Zambians, we are very sensitive people. Mm. Listen to what I just told you. I said, I did not like Boman Musam. Yes, yes. But looking at what happened to him, mm. I sympathize with the man. Mm. Why? I'm a parent. Mm. I'm a man. When I look, look, you look at you where you are, Mr. Taylor may not agree mm. to this. Mm. But the truth is that you are afraid to speak your mind no, right no, no. now at the moment. No, no, no. Deep Let, down listen, your heart. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's not that uh, uh, I have hidden this. No, I've said it. May I say it? My friend, yesterday I was in court. Today I, I, I was in court. Tomorrow I'll be in court. On Friday I'll be in court. Do you think I want to, to be careless in my talking? No, I don't want. I don't you, want you more, more, now, more this police. Is, this is a... This is exactly what we are talking about. They warned us, they told us that HH is vindictive. And it is disappointing that he's living up to that fact today. It is so disappointing. Personally, I am so disappointed. I'm very, very much disappointed. I spent my own money, my own resources. I did not even, nobody even knows me in UPND just so that we can put this government in power, so that we can build a democracy. Some of us live in the diaspora. Mm. We only have one place and one Zambia. And looking at them destroying the, our nation, killing our democracy, especially now, especially these same people that, were, that went through the hands of PF, were tortured. It is so disheartening and so disappointing. Now, thank you, thank my brother. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Now, um, allow me, before I take another caller, and allow me to um, make a comment on, on this issue. Um, you see, they say it takes two to tango. This is where I'm going to start. It takes two to tango. Yes, we have a democracy. That's for sure. We have a democracy. And uh, we are free to express ourselves, we are free to associate, we are free to move about, we are free to pray, uh, you know, we, we, with whatever uh, religion or whatever. So we have got these freedoms, that is for sure. And uh, for political parties, they have got the right to offer checks and balances, to offer checks and balances. Unfortunately, what is happening at the moment, what is happening at the moment, and please follow me very carefully, what is happening at the moment, there is some kind of a political strategy. There is a political strategy. And this political strategy is where, like, where we are trying to politicize everything. Trying to politicize everything. Please follow me very well and follow me with logic, eh? with reasoning. There is a political strategy. There is some kind of a political strategy. This political strategy, which, I mean, even myself, I, I participated in it. And if anything, I could even say that I started it. I could start, I started it, if, if, if you like. And what is that political strategy? The political strategy which is there is to label this government that this government has failed. Okay? And I, I for one, I for one, I am one of those people. If anything, I might say I am the first one that, that brought out these political strategies. To label this government that this government has failed. 
remember I used to say, Haka inde ichirema na firwa. At one point I even came up to say, Haka inde ichirema must resign. Haka inde ichirema must be impeached. You remember those, uh, those of you who have been following me. Those are political strategies. And uh, so, and, 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 so this government has failed. Frankly speaking, at that point, I was even pushing for an early election. I was even pushing for an early election. I was even pushing for an early election. But these are political strategies. These are political strategies. It is there in politics, and there is no crime in doing that. There is no crime in doing that. And because of those political strategies, I... I, 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 I invited trouble on myself. And of course, when you are coming up with these political strategies where you want to label a government that the government has failed, you must bring an alternative. <laughs> you must... <laughs> I'm even laughing with myself because really, some of you, I mean, as much as um, <laughs> you, might, you might think that I'm a pushover, I'm not a pushover. I sit and I, you know, I think and I come up with these things. So, I started these things. Remember, it's me who said, Haka in the HD must fail. Haka in the HD must resign. Haka in the HD must be impeached. I was talking about these things. And, of course, when you are talking about this, that the government has failed, the guy who is there has failed, you must show people an alternative. And I quickly went to Edgar Lungu. I saw Edgar Lungu was already sold. I went to Edgar Lungu, asked him, can you come back? At first he refused, but later on, when he refused, I picked Mundubila. When I picked Mundubila, later on, by Edgar Lungu saw that, e, this thing is gaining momentum. He showed interest. And I brought back the Alebo de Rapport agenda. So, partly, I want to raise my hands to say, I am guilty that I started some of these political uh, issues. Some of these things that people are talking about are things that I actually brought out and uh, implanted them in the minds of the people. Like the issue of the, the shrinking of democracy. It's me who said this government is a dictator. It was a political strategy. And I came out strongly. I came out strongly. And trust me, as much as some of you might think that uh, I'm a pushover, a lot of you swallowed those pills that I was giving you. They are like pills. Every day you give. Every day you give. Every day you give. Eventually, people start responding. So some of you, I want to tell you that some of you took my prescription, took my dosages of, you know, labeling this government as a failure, labeling Aka in the HLM as a failure, and of course, labeling this government as a dictator. And of course, unfortunately, this government, this is the mistake that they made. The mistake that they made, when I'm saying that, you know, uh, this government is a dictator. They made a mistake to fall into my trap by coming to me, arresting me so many times. Trust me, when they were arresting me so many times, they were falling into my trap. They were falling into my trap. Because they were confirming what I was talking about. When I come here, I say, this government is a dictator. This government is a dictator. And for them, the more I say he's a dictator, the more they come here. The more they even intensify on their activities. They even start sending now people masked up with guns. I go and complain, they lock me up. They were confirming what I was saying. They were confirming what I was saying. And a number of you now believed what I was saying. To say, yeah. It's true what he, talk, what he talks about. These guys are dictators. Look what they are doing to his house. And they were really fall, falling into my, into my trap because, look, I've got cameras all over eh, around this house. I've got cameras all over. And when they were coming, I was catching, eh, catching them on cameras and putting them on social media. They were falling into my trap. Trust me, in a gonna If I had money, that's, I'm, I mean, I'm just being honest. But now, what about now? There is a change 
of, 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 man, of mind. There are times when you look at to say, look, as much as I'm doing this, I'm engaging these political strategies. But are they productive? Are they good for the country? So I reached the, a realization where I had so many cases, Uku, even now I've got so many cases. But then when I look at it on the other side, I said, okay, even if I'm doing these things, I even don't have people to help me. You know, I don't have the resources, people to help me. You need, you need a good legal team that you are paying well. Not, Avama lawyers, Wakupa Patira, Mulikwisa, please come and stand for me, whatever, whatever. It, it, it can't work. It can't work. But then you also look at the other aspect. If we change government, if we push this government out, let's imagine tomorrow we have an election. Let's just imagine tomorrow we have an election. Tomorrow we have an election. And Haka in the goes. Are you telling me we are going to make some, some gains? Are we going to move? Trust me, as we are right now, if we remove Haka in the Ichirema today, we remove Haka in the Ichirema today, we would not be going forward. We would actually be going back. Haka in the Ichirema so far has made some positive strides. And I'm not saying this at Indeti, na ah uh ah. -uh. I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you like a repentant sinner, like a repentant criminal. Here I'm telling you like a repentant political uh, strategist, political propaganda, propagandist. Mungu mfugisha, I'm talking to you as a repentant political strategist, political, a political uh, repentant uh, propagandist. Those things that I was talking about, I was making sure I wanted to paint this government bad. I wanted to paint this government bad. And of course, I was hoping that, you know, when we kick them out, I knew I wouldn't be president immediately. That's why I was pushing the, the Avena Munduvide, I was pushing Avena uh, Edgarungu, because I knew I wouldn't. I know I've got, I need some more years. I need to be part of government. I need to make money somehow. I need to make connections before I step up on that platform for me to say, now I want to be president. But for now, since I can't be president, I have to push others. That's why some of you young people who don't understand you, you are, but how come you're always talking about others? You're always talking about others. It is a political strategy. I don't have what it takes. I don't have everything. It is like an, a, 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 a soldier who is going into a war. You must make sure that you have all the ammunition. You have all your people around you. And then you go in. What is the point of going in when you don't have ammunition, you don't have whatever, whatever? You know, you don't. So you hire yourself to work with others. This is why you see me trying to work with others. And some of these people that I want to work with, it's me who actually propel them. Valungu, Valungu's time is gone. It is me who was trying to bring him back. And some of you who were thinking that, you know, you can push the agenda. You can never push the agenda of Walewe Rapo. You can never bring Walungu into presidency. You can't. With me on the other side, in Demieva. You can't bring Walungu into power with me opposing it. You can't, in Demieva. I pushed that agenda and you believed it because I pushed it, that Walewe Rapo. And you looked at it to say, ah, it's possible to wear it up. The moment I put back, I wear it up is gone. And it is gone. It is gone. It will not come back. Valungu can never come back as president unless a miracle happens. So I am speaking to you as a repentant that look, I have changed. And what has made me change? What has made me change? I'm being honest with you. The issues of resources. I mean, going to police and whatever, whatever, whatever. I mean, it was just too much. And then secondly, really, even if I had the money and I succeed in this, can I move the country? Will the country move forward? Imagine to Awesha Walungu. Will the country move forward? The country will never move forward. It will never move forward. And you know, it is one thing when you know somebody from afar. When you know people close by, then you realize, you measure them. You measure them. Some of you, you see people from afar and you think that there is something. But really, when you bring them close, then you realize to say, ah, tapari filipo. Tapari filipo. Chimo na kwa tifidawa wa gero. You know? 
eh va gero vamos va gero ngo amuno me shale mo ka mwino you think that if u uh, you, you but at the end of the day mdara wasanga tapali filipo so even in politics it's like that sometimes you get excited you see some of these people you think that ah u uh, you u uh, you u uh, you but when you bring them close when you know them you come to realize to say ah tapali filipo when I started the Alewe Rapu, when I was looking at Valungu, I thought he can do it. But after being close with him, being close with him, engaging with him, I realized he can't, he can't do it. I realized he can't manage to be president. He can't. I realized Valungu cannot do us anything. He can't. He can't. He can't. He can't take us forward. So even if we succeeded, he wouldn't take us anywhere. So this is what made me change my mind. This is what made me change my mind. Now, getting back to this caller, that this government is showing, is following the same path. Some people have picked up my agenda. But PF and some of these guys, they have picked up my agenda. They, are, they have continued on that same trajectory, on that strategy which I introduced. They have continued they have picked up some of my strategies and they are running with them. They are running with them. They are running with them saying this government has failed. They are running with it. They are running with it that this government is a dictator. They are running with it. And unfortunately, this government is making the same mistake that they were making on me. The same mistake of arresting me. They arrested me nine times, nine times. They are making the same mistake now following some of these people who are politically dead. Some of these people, they are politically dead. And you are making a mistake by following them. You think you are, you are, you are trying to intimidate them, but in the eyes of the public, you are messing yourself up. You are messing yourself up. They have picked up their agenda. Of making this government look like it is a failure. Making Haka Inde Ishirigma look like he's a failure. They are making this government look like it's a dictator. They are creating that narrative. And in the name of government, you are making the same mistake that you are making on me. Arresting them day, every day, every day, every day. They are gaining. They are gaining. Some of these people, they are not worth the the investment that you are putting in there is so much investment there is so much investment they are not worth it they are not worth it to grace the news the public media but these people they are covered a politician a politician worth his sort is must be discussed in the news every day Every day. And some of these people, by the fact that you are arresting them, Boman de Loma Mwikata, Mairo Mwikata, Mairo Mwikata, Mairo Arikukoti, Boman, you are keeping Boman alive. You are keeping Boman alive. And before you know it, like the caller said, people will start sympathizing with Boman. Before they didn't like Boman, because Ale Lopola Van Tifkoti, because he was arrogant, because he was what, 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 what. But now Bowman cannot do those things because he doesn't have the power. So, but what are you doing? You are busy talking about Bowman. Busy talking about Bowman. Eh, People start sympathizing with him. They will forget about the bad things that he did. And they will start looking at the bad things that you are doing to him. Same, same, Navalungu Chimochini. Valungu, people who eventually forget the bad things that Valungu did. How bad, you know, he failed the economy. They will forget. They will be, be sympathizing. So, this is for my brothers and sisters in UPND. That be very careful. You might think that you are winning this, but you are actually falling into the ditch. Especially these instances whereby, sorry, no bomber, no, 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 because in that Amufumishe, you will also be looking back to say, ah, how many days, Bowman? Hey, three days. Hey, four days. Yeah, Bowman. Then in Amufumia, he will be, yeah, I'm a champion. I'm a champion. You are losing out. You are losing out. 
And these are the issues that UPND need to look at. You are wasting time with these people. Instead of looking at how can you convince people that President Haka in the has moved this country forward. How can you convince people that President Haka in the is the right president at the moment? How can you convince the people out there that in spite of the challenges, this is the government that they should have confidence in? This is what should preoccupy your mind. This is what you should be investing in. But you are investing, Muriwa Kapokola. Invest in the PR. Show that Haka in the is a Republican president who is working night and day, who is not going to Italy to go and enjoy, who is not going to Germany just to go for, for a $500 uh, dollars allowance, but is going there to work. This is what should preoccupy your mind. But you are not focusing on that by UPND. You are not. You are focusing on it. who is saying what? Who is saying what? You arrest them. And then you are also, you are very reactive. You are very reactive. The Ministry of Information by UPND. You know, you, so this guy has just provoked me to talk. I wanted, I, didn't, I wanted to avoid this. The Ministry of Information is not a reactive ministry. It is not a ministry to counter propaganda. That is not a ministry. That is not the job of that ministry. That is not the job of that ministry. And I hope my friends can, can hear this. The Ministry of Information and Media, it is not a ministry to counter pro, uh, propaganda. No. It is not a ministry, you know, to, 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 to cover up a, a imingalato. No. That is not the job of that ministry. That ministry is supposed to inform people to inform the PR of the president, the PR of the government is in the hands of that ministry. That is, that is the job of that ministry. It is not to be responding to Bowman. It is not to be responding to Chirufatayali. It is not to be, to, to be reporting that, no, this person has been arrested. because That is not the job of that ministry. It is, it is reducing the ministry in Demieva. It is reducing the ministry to reduce it to be churches, churches. That is not the job of that ministry. That ministry, Mdala, is to do PR. PR, serious PR, Mdala. Serious PR. Telling the people what the government is doing. Engaging with people. That ministry should be, you know, should be the, the personification of the government. The Minister of Information must be somebody that is all over. I don't want to come out to talk like I'm criticizing anyone. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. I'm just, I'm just telling you. I mean, my brother Cornelius is there. He's a good friend of mine. I don't want to talk like, you know, I'm, 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 uh, I'm criticizing him. No, you know, I mean, after all, he's just new in that ministry. But, but really, at the moment, you have turned that ministry to be always reacting. Oh no, hey, the church has said this. Oh, this person has said this. You are always reacting. You are always reacting. When you are supposed to be setting up the agenda. When you are supposed to be setting up the agenda. That ministry is supposed to be loaded with so many things that government is doing. The propaganda that we are talking about, it should be coming from that ministry. You are the one who is supposed to be starting with the propaganda. Oh, as government, we need to do this. But before we do this, we need to tell people. Oh, how do we make people aware? You leash it out. By the time you are coming out, people are voting. So, I brought this in them. You can argue. I am a politics. I'm the one that brought these strategies. They are just working in what I started. And I didn't mind Vakapokola coming to arrest me because I was making a name. I knew what I was doing. The problem is I was failed by those who were supposed to, sub to support me. They failed me. But then, on the other hand, maybe it was by God's grace 
that they didn't support me because really even if we succeeded i don't think we would have helped zambians i believe that the trajectory that i've taken is a better trajectory at the moment it's a better trajectory than the trajectory that i was pursuing uh last time this is dj mutati exclusive Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.